So we made a lot of progress recently. We got the dragon defeated. It's nearly the for afternoon tea. Um, looks like people are pretty hurt. I'm apparently up here on a mountain. Not sure if that was on purpose or if they just got me here. I don't remember. Um, let's go ahead and get our login bonus. Alright. I like this game because it gives you very clear direction on where to go. Um, you can definitely see these are daily quests. You've got Dark Knight's Hero Crisis was next. Tell Deluke about the war declaration. That was what I was about to do, but that one involved me starting um, to enter into another uh, long quest, like enter into a, a dungeon. So I wanted to check, do that first. All right, and they tell you where to go. So see this little arrow right here in the map? Points exactly where to go. So I'll go ahead and go to here. There's lightning in this game too. Not just in my neighborhood. <laughs> What do you call lightning bolts? If you call animo wind, geo is earth, then what would lightning be? There would be a word for that too. Electro maybe. All right, Diluc. Just now, we were at the Knights of Avonius, and and. I take it you're about to inform me of the war declaration from the Abyss Order. I'm aware of it, though I appreciate you for taking the trouble to come all this way. What? The Don Winery's intelligence network extends beyond commercial matters. Great. So, what's the plan, Master Diluc? I'm open to suggestions. Stay at the winery till this blows over. That would be tantamount to handing this over to the knights. Had they been worthy of this task to begin with, things would never have escalated to this point. In any case, circumstances are not dire enough to warrant me going into hiding and leaving the knights to deal with the consequences. Ooh, the Abyss Order has really dealt you a tough hand this time. What a sneaky little bunch those guys are! There is a way. But for it to work, I need some more information. Specifically, I need to decipher the obscured portions of the Abyss Order's war declaration. Obscured portions? You mean the bits Paimon can't read? It must be a cipher only understood by members of the Abyss Order, used to spread messages within the organization. If they knew we can't read it, why would they write it in the first place? It's not simply a war declaration, but also a notification to their own. When you take a stand that makes you a hero to one party, you also become a villain to the other. And since I've been the Abyss Order's enemy for so long, they've made me the target around which they can rally their troops and unite their strengths. Wow! Seems like it takes a lot of brains to be a superhero, huh? I understand my enemy well, is all. As the saying goes, heroes and villains are two sides of the same coin. So what are we gonna do about the intel that's written in gibberish, then? How do we... un... gibberish... by it? Simple. When you don't understand something, you ask. I've already tracked down one of their strongholds. If you're interested, feel free to come along. Let's do it. Probably could have worked, but... I'll follow the line, maybe it's close. Maybe their stronghold is right under my nose. 
thousand feet, I'm warping. It's at the Temple of the Lion. This is the place. Abandoned ruins like these are precisely the kind of place the Abyss Order likes to camp out. Come on. There's no time to lose. Alright. They recommend fire. I have another fire I could swap out. Let's go back. Let's see if we can uh, change my team to be more fire centric. All right, we could take out official. We could take out Lisa. Lisa's only at twenty. Oh, I thought I had another fire. Never mind. Uh, let's still bring in you. You're a healer esque. I will protect you. Yes, you will. All right, now I'm ready. Oh, they gave me another choice anyway. Now I know. Arrive at the depths of the abyss stronghold. Done. Whoa, he looks super strong. Looks like he's wielding a giant claymore. Oh. You can just hold down the attack button and look at this. This does non stop attacking. Oh yeah. Well that was easy. What's this thing over here? I don't know. Oh, I, did I wake that up yet? I did. Alright, I'll open the door. You always want to check and see if there's any like extra chests or anything like that around. They might have some useful stuff. Something. Or... Wow. That was awesome. Oh, dear. a purple thing at me, but now he has no defense. I guess the downfall of doing this non-stop attack thing that he can do is he's more vulnerable. But I think the pros outweigh the cons. Look at that. That was easy. I need to get D Luke, that's for sure. I need to get that door. I got a rock thingy I could probably knock down. Yep. Ooh, a chest. Time for retribution. Yeah, that was nice. I'll get the next one. All right, I can knock down this wall and alert that other chest. Why do they keep giving me foul? Do they think I'm not able to shoot down my own birdies in the game? There's a million of them. Another guy. Nope. 
That would be it. Ooh, a potato. Was there anything else around here? It did not look like. I think that was it. All right, move on. D Loop can probably take out this whole village. If he gets hurt, I'll switch to uh, Noel and heal him. Let's just do one at a time. Looks like every time you get a hit, he continues. Every time he moves, he gets electrocuted. I think it's a slight delay here. Let's see. Not very strong. <laughs> All right. Ooh, I get a boss. Where's my boss? There he is. He's a water boss. I need to freeze him, but I don't have any freezing people. This would be interesting. Try Camera zooming in, not working. She's way stronger than Noel. But she's also weak. That's what I'm talking about. Now let's get some damage. With the wind. All right, let's try D. Luke. Are you gonna come back and? Oh wow! Let's finish him off. Done. Interrogate the mage. How did you find me here, Favodian scum? I am no knight of Favodius. Now start talking. Your plan, what is it? I see you received our letter. But if you think I'm going to let you in on our secrets, I'm afraid you're quite mistaken. Wanna bet? <laughs> You appear to have misunderstood the situation you are in. Burn him with your searing hand. Did you just use a pyro vision to shoot fire from your hands? Ah, it burns! 
Let's see how long it takes for you to crack. Burn him with your searing hand again. Interrogate him. You'd be foolish enough to keep anything else hidden. Challenge completed. Any missing chests? Oh, talk about giant chests. Cha-ching. Hero's wit for leveling up my characters. And stuff. Ooh, a wheat. Who doesn't like wheat? Gluten intolerant people, maybe. Alright. I'm just gonna move on. If it was that big, I don't think there's anything else. Thank you, D Luke. That was good work. Now we go to the city gate at 10 p.m. Now that I have the information I need, I must prepare. It's getting dark. I would be grateful if you could keep me updated on how the Knights of Favonius respond to this matter. Let's find out. Yes, Master Diluc, sir. Anything you say, Master Diluc, sir. <laughs> Why are you acting so strange all of a sudden? In, in light of what just went down here a moment ago... Don't burn me. Master Diluc has officially reached number one on Paimon's people not to tick off under any circumstances list. <laughs> Talk to Huffman. As if anyone knows where that is. Alright. Huffman, 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 where are you? Oh, you're in the city, of course. Right, I'm gonna stop by here real quick, heal up, and then get over to Huffman. Sound like a plan? Official! Come on, Fischl. Heal up. There we go. Gonna land on his head. We do not make contact with the Dark Knight hero soon. Hmm. What do we do about the challenge? Ah, it's you two. I must admit, this issue of the Dark Knight hero is proving to be something of a headache. We've just held a meeting to decide on an appropriate course of action. Can you guess what it is? Bury our heads firmly in the sand. Just kidding. Join no, forces. That would send a signal that the Knights are in favor of the Dark Knight's hero's continued presence in our city, which we are not. Encouraging this kind of individual heroism undermines the knight's authority. Oh, yeah? Oh, well, what's the plan then? Find out the Dark Knight hero's true identity and offer him our protection. Protection? He seems to be doing just fine without your protection so far, you know. 
Well, since you've aided the knights in the past, I might as well just tell you. The offer of protection is just a ruse, in order for the Knights of Favonius to take over full and exclusive responsibility for this matter. You aren't gonna let the Dark Knight hero be all heroic and stuff? Why not? Firstly, to show the might of the Knights of Favonius, to prove to the people that without the Dark Knight hero, they can still rely on the Knights to maintain peace and harmony. Firstly. Secondly, the Abyss Order have no mercy in their hearts. If anything happened to the Dark Knight hero, it would only serve to further their nefarious ambitions. Gosh, I would never knew the life of a knight involved so much untold anguish before. But none of this will work if we don't establish the Dark Knight hero's true identity in time. There's no need to despair, Huffman. Just follow my plan, and everything will be fine. Ah, uh, Captain Kaya! Lately, Master D. Luke has been working the bar at the Angel's Share every night. All I need you to do is keep him in your sight. Think you can manage that for me? Uh, yes, Captain Kaya. But does that mean that Master D. Luke is the Dark Knight hero? Who knows? It's just a hunch. I've been known to be wrong on occasion. Quest completed. Wow. Paimon feels we saw a whole new side of the Knights of Favonius today. But Paimon doesn't understand. How is Kaya so sure he knows who the Dark Knight hero is? We need to get to the winery and tell Master D. Luke as soon as Paimonly possible. Paimonly, we're gonna work there. Warping back and forth. This winery has a lot of business. I should make a warp point there. Save me about, you know, five minutes every single time I need to start a new quest. That's okay. I don't mind darting across like that. That was easy. I didn't even have to play anymore. Furnish Diluc with the info. Master Diluc, Paimon has something important to tell you. Yes, about Kaya. I should have known he would see this as the perfect opportunity to get back at me. Sounds like there's a bit of bad blood between you guys then. I shan't get into that now. More importantly, the Knights of Favonius are responding more or less as I had anticipated. All we need to do now is think of a counter plan. Do you have any ideas? Patience. Let me think for a moment. Hmm. If they intend to monitor me, then so be it. We can use this to create the perfect alibi. What's an alabla? An alibi? If you want to find out, maybe you can do me a small favor first. Oh, come on! Why do you love cliffhangers so much? In Mondstadt, mist flowers are most commonly found in a region just northwest of the winery. I got some. If you could gather some for me, I'd be most grateful. I will make up. I'll make preparations in the meantime, is what he said. I have to apparently leave here. Probably so he can disappear. I could always get more mist flowers. I think I have one already. Get four mist flowers to deal with. Alright, let's see if I have four. I don't know if I have four. Ah, you're back. Allow me to introduce the winery's master brewer. So many mist flowers. Great. 
I can't wait to see how this turns out. So, are you certain the equipment can withstand this level of purity? Oh my, my goodness. The winery owner himself is addressing me directly. Oh. Uh, don't worry, sir. It is always my honor to serve you, even if it means risking my life. Huh? What's so life-threatening about this? Uh, please, excuse me. I must get to work. What's he gonna do with a bunch of mist flowers? Long story short, a few days ago, the winery was experimenting with some new flavors. They wanted to see if mist flower can truly add a crisp and refreshing taste. Sure enough, they discovered that the flower's extract is truly potent. So the new batch is selling like hotcakes? No, not potent in terms of attracting customers, but slimes. Slimes need to extract elemental energy to survive. For them, this substance is simply irresistible. So I thought to myself, I wonder how much trouble I could cause now that I know this. Hmm. Bing, crash, wallop. What was that noise? Oh, cold. So cold. <laughs> oh, Master D. Luke. Purification complete, sir. But the equipment is... Frozen? Marvelous work. Don't fret about the equipment. I shall have my butler order more immediately. Marvelous! Jelly ho! Spiffing! Somebody fetch the butler! Pyma never knew you had to be so well-spoken to get a job in the alcohol industry. <laughs> this is what I was talking about. Mist flower extract. Or, for our purposes, elemental bait. Wow! It really has a strong elemental lift. Can we test it out? Sprinkle a little on the ground over there. Careful, just a small amount. Nothing's happening. I have to talk to him to start the video? Is that how it works? We're watching. Squelch, squelch. Holy moly, it really does attract slimes! And even more than we expected! It appears the potency is greater than anticipated. We'd better get rid of them before they wreak havoc on the manor. Oh gee. Oh gee. We got this. Opponents incoming. I must leave. Opponents incoming. How come D-Luke can't fight them off? He, he's even better at fighting than I am. Wow, 
That is powerful. Midnight Phantasmagoria. Frozen. Read the sign board while I'm frozen there. Summer special. Great juice. Two bottles for one Mora. What a deal. Sold out. Ooh, such a powerful effect from such a small amount of extract. At least we didn't go picking wildflowers for nothing. <laughs> Alright, so can you tell us what your plan is now, Master D. Luke? Yes. The plan is... And so, I expect it to all go down without a hitch. Did I click through it or did he not say it? Hmm. Are you sure it will work? You're the only person in the plan. I have persevered alone from the start. Now, I alone must face what lies ahead. If you already made up your mind. But until that moment comes, we can still help you out where we can. Isn't that right? Sure. I am indeed indebted to you. I shall see you at the tavern, as per the plan. Let's wait until evening to meet Master Diluc at the tavern. Wait till the evening? Oh, I can fast forward that one. Oops. I don't want to read that. I already read that. What is that noise? I think it's going thump thump. Oh, I need to wash it. Hunter. Go to the tavern. Oh, upstairs I got something. Fox and the Dandelion at the Sea, 8th edition. Okay. Or the 8th book. Alright, go to the tavern. That's a long way off. It's in the city. Um, it said wait till nighttime. I'll, I'll go there and then turn it to nighttime. Expedition reward. Items for. Oh, that's all city stuff. I created another universe. Mm. What are you doing, Hertha? What do you need from me? Tell me a little about your stuff. Blah, 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 blah. That's nice. I wonder why they have a triangle on. I'll wait till nighttime. Let's go now and see what happens. It's not night. Wait until 7 p.m. Do I wait until 7 p.m. and then come in, or I just fast forward till 7 p.m.? Let's check the mail while we're waiting. Ooh, an event. A web event. More rewards that I never picked up. Still waiting. I'll use the clock. Clockity clock clock. 19 o'clock. Current time is... Let's move to... Uh, oh, I don't know. 19.
Oh, look at that. We're there. Yep, there he is. I see him. Hello there, Diluc. Diluc. Greetings, Mr. Hoffman of the Knights of Fabonius. To what do I owe the pleasure of this hour? I'm spying on you. Oh, uh, nothing. I'm merely procrastinating. I thought I might indulge myself with a beverage or two. Ah, Traveler. Fancy meeting you here. Oh, we were in the mood for an evening stroll. What would you like to drink? I'll have a dandelion wine, I suppose. Ooh, why don't I want apple juice? Can I start a tab? Apologies, we do not give credit here. Well, in that case, let this be my treat. No need, we'll be back in a jiffy. Please. Huffman <sighs> showed up. Okay, remember the plan? Go to the city side gate and place the elemental bait. Whoa! You used all of it! This is gonna be pretty epic! <laughs> Yikes! Here comes the slimes! Quick, let's get to the tavern before anyone spots us! Captain Kaya is no doubt a formidable knight, but he also brings us more than his share of hassle. Uh, no, no, this isn't right. I should not be talking about my superior in such a manner. If he were to overhear me... We're back! Is my apple juice ready? <laughs> One moment. <laughs> Mr. Hoffman! Mr. Hoffman! A situation at the side gate! Everyone to the side gate! What is it? What happened? Uh, it's... Slimes, Mr. Huffman. Slimes. You see them all the time. What's the big panic? We do, but... Sir, there are more slimes out there now than all the slimes I've seen in my life added together. Uh, whoa. Surely this couldn't be the Abyss Order's secret weapon. But I have another matter to attend to here. Oh? The matter of your dandelion wine? No, no I, I, uh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> hmm. So this is how the Knights of Favonius conduct themselves in a crisis. The Abyss Order is encroaching on the city gates, and your response is to sit here drinking wine? It's like I've always said, the Knights are not to be trusted. I... Gotcha. Uh, Master G. Luke is right. My conduct here has been below par. I shall set off at once. But first, may I have a quiet word? Huh? Shh, keep your voice down. I presume you know what this is about. Please watch D. Luke for me. Do not let him leave under any circumstances. I must head to the side gate, but I'll be back shortly. I'm counting on you. Good. That's him out of the way. Everything's going according to plan. I must get going too. I won't have a second to spare if I'm to be back in time. Face the abyss order head on at the front gate. Let's warp there, and like last time where I forgot.
Oh, okay. Priority quest. You're not allowed to teleport. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't teleport in those, apparently. Ah, there you are. Dealing with you will be the easy part. Glad better you than me. That was pretty cool. Kick him in the water, dude. Defeat the attackers. It's like a never ending fireball. Could melt him with amber. No one escapes my sight. There we go. Now let's do D loop for the final. To defeat all of them? few hilly trolls. No time to chat. I don't know how long those slimes will keep Hoffman occupied. Best get back to the tavern. Can I warp now? <sighs> or I don't know. Right, that's settled. Let's get back to the tavern. You think Hoffman is back yet? No chance. I would mess up the whole thing. Although I wonder, if I were to completely go astray and get distracted by something, say, items or a quest or a chest or something... Hey, Patton, don't say anything, okay? You didn't see nothing, Mr. Patton. Patton's like, I'm gonna be a defensive master. James Hoffman hasn't yet returned. He made it in time. The situation is sorted now. 
I never expected that the Abyss Order's army would turn out to be nothing more than a few slimes. That is a surprise. <laughs> Perhaps the Knight's true calling is to be slime exterminators. Who knows? Domestic pest control may turn out to be a more valuable use of your resources. <sighs> Master D. Luke, please, have you no respect at all? Well, how come you're sweating so much? You didn't leave, did you? <laughs> it's really warm in here. I did some squats. Is that so? But why now, of all times, for the love of Barbados? Uh, I was bored. Excuse me, sir. Might I be so bold as to inquire? Did you see Master D. Luke? Uh, I mean, today's bartender. Uh, did you see him leave just now? Yikes! He's asking other customers where to die for. Master D. Luke? Why, no. He's been behind the bar this entire time. I see. Mr. Huffman, your dandelion wine. You ought to get back after this. Send my regards to the rest of the knights. Oh, never mind. I must be going. I should report back. Here, take this as a token of my esteem. Hmm, how odd. I foresaw this eventuality. So, all the guests here tonight, save you two, are my own people from the Dawn Winery. They're all in on it? Not all of them. Or should I say, not all of us. Kaya, where did you come from? I just picked a good spot to quietly sit and watch the show. What? You've been here this whole time? Correct. The Dark Knight Heroes Alibi. I think it's my favorite chapter so far. More intriguing than a fine wine. <sighs> so, you plan to report everything to the Knights of Favonius? <laughs> Come now, D. Luke. You know me better than that. I have no interest in exposing secrets. I was just curious to see how far Mondstadt's Dark Knight hero would really go. And you did not disappoint. I have nothing to prove to you. Oh, naturally. I must say, though, one thing I didn't see coming is that the mighty Dark Knight hero would actually need help from other people. Sorry. We're closing. Please see yourselves out. All right, all right. I have no further need of wine to entertain myself tonight in any case. Just one last thing before I go. It had better be the very last thing. I feel strangely comforted by the fact you now have an assistant, T. Luke. <sighs> I hope you all have a wonderful night. A little creepy there. A little cold. What was all that about? <sighs> Don't mind him. Thank you for all your help with this matter. This is a token of my gratitude. Wow! Thanks, Master D. Luke. I'm in the habit of working alone. But... I did enjoy having your assistance this time. In the future, if there's anything you ever need, you can come to me for help. Friend. To be continued. 60 crystals. Or primo gems, whatever you call them. Wish. Beginner's Wish. Farewell to Shiznaya. Can't afford that. Maybe if I bought it with crystals. 
This is this childy guy. I already have two of those characters, or that girl. These are a bunch of weapons. Bunch of other characters. I don't see Duluk as an option here. This one would probably be pretty good, but I already have those two. I'll wait, I'll hold out and save my crystals for a Diluc or a Venti or something Whenever you need slightly me. I'll be there. more exciting. Alright, let's see. Where do we want to go from here? This one requires Adventure Rank 23, Rite of Dissension. This one requires Adventure Rank 26. So I need Adventure Rank. So basically I need to complete some quests and get some rank there. Everything they say is close by, but I don't know. Just leeway, that's not even... I'm checking to see what would be good. Check the crystal or crystal ore in Storm Terror Lair. Let's do that one. I'm skipping that song. Someone needs assistance. Okay. Get all that crystal. I'll collect all the crystals, hope they don't mind. They'll grow back. <laughs> that was an easy quest. They want me to go to a different one now. I guess I could walk over there, that's not too far. Ooh, there's a chest. It gives him adventure rank for beating these guys. Whoa, I jumped too far. Here. Okay, firecracker, we hear you whining. Getting some noise. Meowing, freeze. He's like hovering on nothing. I need a uh, archer. There we go. We'll take it. Yeah, see, ex adventure experience gained. Ooh, I see a blue fairy over here. Hello, blue Seely. Follow you. Ooh. There's a chest.
I'll go on top of that one. Okay, here. We'll take it. Exquisite chest. And experience. Probably up in the sky. Maybe not. The fire one. I've been shocked. Here we go. It's my claymore. That was that, and then we got one more, which is a pretty far walk. We'll go ahead and pick up this chest while we're out here. I'll pick up a few of them. Plus 20. I'm almost to 23. A few more of those. What did I get over here? Mine 10 items. Okay. And then I was going to warp over there. Oops. Ooh, there's a chest way over there. Is that too far? Need to get it eventually anyway. I'll get these crystals first. Ooh, there's some rocks over there to break. Awesome. I can get those with the claymore as well. Give crystal chunks to Wagner. Oh, I have to give them to him, huh? You assumed I picked them up. I'll get I'll break the rocks, I'll get those chests, and then I'll head back to work. I'll catch up. There's a question mark on the screen too. Oh, they're just saying in that general direction, not necessarily right there. Someone needs assistance. Freezing guy, I don't want this guy to nice. <laughs> hey, recipes. Learn the Mora meat. Learn the almond toku. Obtain that. Smoke fowl. Obtain that. Ugar. And obtain that sausage. Alright. Let's go ahead and cook a bunch more. We already have five. Let's do more hams. Cook some sugar. Cook some crab roe. Jam. Bacon. Flour. 
we got some already. Okay. Cool. Looking out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, so what was I doing? I was going to head back to that quest and finish it. the crystals. Catherine, I knew I had somebody exploring that needed to pick up stuff. Nobody? This way with a mask? This one? Baidu? to mine any ore? I have it right here. Let me see how huh? these crystals actually don't look half bad. Here's your payment. Take it for your trouble. This means a storm around Storm ter Terror's lair has indeed dispersed. I should make time to go there myself soon. Ooh, 23. Now I can do that new quest. Right of Dissension. Go to Leeway Harbor. No wonder you were master. Awesome. Let me quickly grab my reward for going up level and then I will head back to Leeway. Claim rewards. Wow, a bunch of stuff. What was that sundial thingy? Uh, I gotta see what that sundial was. I'll bet you that sundial has to do with that island that I was trying to get to. Sundial, sundial, sundial. There it is. Oh, cake for the traveler. Aww. Gift given on a special day for my birthday. Okay. I don't see the sundial thing. I'm just looking in case I'm not seeing it. What a mystery. Alright. I'm I'll figure it out. There we go. Rate of dissension. But, uh, if you find the Geo Archon, this is the only chance you'll get all year. Guess it's a good thing Venti brought it up earlier. Otherwise, we definitely would have missed this year's Rite of Dissension. You know when it is? Uh, might be today. Might also be tomorrow. Or next week. Look, we're already in Liyue, so let's go ask some of the locals. Oh, right. About the Geo Archon, Morax. Did you know the mora that we use is named after this god? Really? But it seems as impolite for people from outside Liyue to refer to the Geo Archon by that name. What do you call him? So we should refer to the Geo Archon by the name Rex Lapis, like the people of Liyue do. 
Morax, Lex, Rex, Lapis. Totally different. I'll have to remember that. Of the land immense monoliths. Wow. They just opened up a whole bunch of stuffs. Higher 49 meters. I have to climb up there. I don't know. I'll take the stairs. Hello. There we go. Ling Lin Yang. Lin Lang. The funny name. Right of dissension. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Isn't that today? Once a year, Rex Lapis bestows upon us his divine prediction, guiding us on how to run Liu for the coming year. Last year, it was the Yuhang of the Liu of Qixing that was given the honor of asking for the divine prediction. Ooh, Paimon knows this one! Mon's status to freedom as Liu is to contracts. Liyue has a strong focus on business and trade. The Liyue Kissing, the seven leaders of the seven enterprises of Liyue, Liverpool. hold true control over Liyue. That's what foreigners always say. But true control over Liyue will always be held by Rex Lapis. The Kissing is comprised of mere mortals. Rex Lapis is a god. Monstad's god is nowhere to be seen, whilst our god is forever with us. Stay in Liyue long enough and you'll see. Given that you just left your godless city, it's time you experienced what it's like to be in a city whose god has walked with it through all of history. That was one. Now I know. They think I'm godless. Are you also foreigners here for the ride of dissension? <sighs> to think I've lived in Liyue all these years and never come to see this before. <laughs> I guess it's like they say, locals never visit the tourist spots. <sighs> I wish you well on your travels. Liyue always welcomes you. That was it. Next. You too wish to bear witness to the rite of dissension? <laughs> Me too! We all do! As a businessman myself, how could I not take interest in Liyue's most important business trends? The 17 predictions given last year made more than a few ripples throughout the industry. Mm. What's more, there's been a rumor going around that the Tianchua herself, Ning Guang, has been acting secretly in the shadows. She wants the rocks created by GeoVision holders to be exempt from taxation. Wow, that's some super professional legal stuff, that is! <laughs> to be on the pulse of the predictions and the market is what makes this harbor what it is. Among the seven, Rex Lapis is the oldest deity. His keen sense of strategy is well trusted among his people. Understanding the predictions as soon as possible can make all the difference in making your fortune. Fortune? So where can we see this right of dissension anyway? Hmm, you're not at all close. Not to mention that if I gave you directions, as foreigners, you'd get lost along the way. So better to head to Eugene Terrace, to the high ground. It's the highest place in the harbor. Sounds like the best place for trying to communicate with deities, no? I bet I can work. Oh no, it's right there. It's walking distance.
Because it's only 39 away. It's right up on top of this. I gain my energy. And go up. And up. Uh oh. I'm out of... No, I can go this way. I can go sideways. Paimon heard that the best time to make a wish is today, during the rate of dissension. Wanna give it a try? Ta da! Make a wish. Halt! Those not involved in the proceedings are not permitted to go any further. Okay. Kill Joy! Halt! She's good at putting up walls. Let's go around. Place incense in the center. I don't even have incense. Oh, you also want a little adept dialogue too? We're making a wish. <laughs> Seems you know a lot. Making a wish during this time is sure to get you the blessings of both the adept eye and Rex Lapis himself. I've already made my wish, so you can take this. Thank you. Great, thanks. Got the incense. Wish I could find my sister soon. Pray and make a wish. May your wealth multiply in the year ahead. Everyone's wishing for money. Why would they want money? Money's not happiness. Ivanovich, hey, I recognize him. He's from uh, Metal Gear Solid, I think. Your first time in Liga? Actually, it's my first time to see the Rite of Dissension, too. Ah, look, that's Miss Ningguang of the Liu Shishin. Maybe it was 007. Only those who have control in Liu can preside over the Rite of Dissension. Oh yeah, not sure if you knew, but most of the Adepti appear in the form of various beasts. I heard that when attending these kinds of formal occasions, Rex Lapis himself appears as a celestial cross between two of Liu's ancient mythical creatures. Ah, sorry, I shouldn't interrupt your wish. Please, take this. Wish I could get some leads from the Geo Archon. Oh, let's hope. Great! Now that we're all done with the wishing, guess we can just wait here for things to get started. Hmm. Who knows how long that Miss Ning Wong lady is gonna take? Join the crowd, wait for the right to begin. You and Paimon wait for the right to begin. We gotta get up front. We can't see squad back here. It's like five people. she doing to the sky just creating a hurricane why is she doing that oh my gosh 
Somebody attacked us. Yikes. What? What's going on? Did she just say Rex Lapis is... He didn't live very long. The Geo Archon is... dead? Oh no! The Millilith! Looks like they're nabbing suspects who got too close. was a god we faced off against when we first arrived on this world, too. Oh, no. Escape. There's a whole bunch of soldiers out there, too. Oh boy, talk about Metal Gear Solid. You may not be the killer, but we can't let them get you. It's totally... Can we even get out of here safely? It's totally was a, a hint when they said Ivanovich, they were trying to say you're about to get into a Metal Gear Solid thing. This is where you hide. Try to avoid detection. Ah! Huh. Oh. Okay, don't climb up on the rock. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. No idea how to do this. Let's just as quickly as possible get to where we're going. Don't wait for them to run around and find. Me. Did I make it? Never ending. Oh. Hey buddy, hold still. Yikes. Stop! Stop! Come with me. Come with me if you want to live. Just what mu muscles does magical floating use exactly? So insensitive! You have no idea just how tiring floating around- Wait! Just who are you exactly? Call me Child. Child? What, so we're supposed to dote on you? <laughs> no, no, not at all. It's an alias of sorts. In Mondstadt, I don't suppose you came across a Senora by any chance. Senora? Child? <gasps> You're Fatui! We're the Harbingers! Oh, no. Don't worry. I'm not looking for a fight. Senora gave you quite the bad impression, huh? Pfft, that woman. Can't say I'm a fan either. Right. Let's forget all about her, shall we? I'm here to help you. Help? I don't need help from Fatui. Go, leave. All three mean basically the same thing. Yes, help. I'm not a bad guy. Okay, perhaps I'm kind of a bad guy. But I'm not here to give you any trouble. Would it be too much to ask for you to keep the sword sheathed? Sephiroth. Thank you for your knightly nobility. 
I heard of your deeds in Mondstadt, so I couldn't help but notice you during the proceedings back there. And because I had my eye on you the whole time, I know it wasn't you. Someone but, regrettably, given I'm a Fatui envoy from Snezhnaya, there's no way I'd be trusted after something of this magnitude. The ruling Chi Sing of Liyue has always been overly suspicious of us. Well, can you honestly blame them? <laughs> Guess I shouldn't try to deny that. Okay, sure. Maintaining a distance between strangers is probably a good idea. Either way, I'm already used to it at this stage. Six feet, buddy. But right now, if you want to clear yourselves of any suspicion, you need to get yourselves to Northland Bank. Staying here isn't an option. As the old Leo was saying goes, the walls have ears. It gave me a viewpoint. That was all walking there just for that. Here. Okay. Up to the bank. What if you were like disabled and you couldn't climb stairs? Do they have elevators? This bank was opened here in Liyue by Snezhnaya. Though everyone knows Liyue is the most enterprising in Tivat, Snezhnaya is not short of change either. Yeah, well, poorer nations don't seem to tend to have diplomats that come around acting the way yours do towards the Knights of Favonius. <laughs> here, let me give you this. This is a... I'm not sure exactly. Sometimes all money can buy is things, and not a name for oneself. All I know is that it's a sigil. A sigil to keep the mighty and illuminated Adepti from bringing harm to you. Illuminated? Adepti? If you head north from the harbor, then west from Guaili Plains, you will eventually reach a stone forest known as Dweyun Karst. The people of Liyue believe it to be the abode of the Adepti. They really believe that? Legend or not, they believe it. As such, offerings to the Adepti are made at its borders. Nobody dares venture in. But I have no need for believing. Not when I know for a fact that the Adepti truly exist. Hate to admit it, but your Fatui intel seems alright. But why would we go looking for a dead guy anyway? <laughs> oh, my little friend. There are plenty of reasons mortals seek the blessings of a dead guy. Money, health, love. But you, you will go for justice. Justice? The Chief Singh will already have dispatched the Millilith. They'll be seeking out the assassin from amongst the onlookers. But how could a mere mortal kill a god that can sweep aside entire armies? Rex Lapis never gave up his power as a god. This level of crude response is beyond what is called for. How suspicious. You think they're trying to hide the true culprit? You think the Qixing did, did it and they're trying to pin it on someone else? Or to hide something else. Hard to say. Even now, the Northland Bank wouldn't be able to hold the Millilith off for long, but the Adepti can clear you of any wrongdoing. Liyue was founded by the Geo Archon and the Adepti. Of course, it was built by force. Look for them, and be faster than the Chi Sing's messengers, so you may give your version of events first. If there is anyone that can help you in Liyue now, it can only be the mighty and illuminated Adepti. Yeah. 
sigil of permission. Impromptu change of plan. Meet the Adepti a Jalen Cart. Okay. That's not far. Ooh, there's a chest up there. I'm tempted, but I should do the quest first. I can do that. And who might we be? Those that dare enter Dreyung Kars. Whoa. That's some big ears. Strange looking ears. Please look at this. A sigil of permission. Many a season has passed since one was last in the presence of such an item. He before you is the mighty and illuminated Adeptus, Mooncarver. Speak, Traveler. What business have you here? Actually, it's the assassin. They dare to flee here to Dragon Karst. Sir, we've already stepped too far into Dragon Karst ourselves. We. Uh, there's no choice. Apprehending the assassin is top priority. We must press on. Disturbing our borders. See them gone. One will not have interruption. Oh boy. Who goes there? Steady as stuff. Take the, the target alive! As a dutiful maid would. Unleash elemental skills on the back. Take this as a good night show. Giving me unlimited elemental skills. I will think. Still have the unlimited. Two arms with the wind. Take the target. In the alive. middle of this fight, can I go somewhere else? Oh, no. I say I still have these, and I can do them somewhere else. Unlimited would be uh, pretty awesome. Disappear. Oh, no more out of the movie. I'll leave the rest myself. Time to clean up. I must Take the target alive. Goodbye. 
Dark is alive. Digressed. State your purpose, traveler. Well. Preposterous. Preposterous. The Liyue Qixing. Utterly disappointing. How could someone possibly assassinate Rex Lapis during the rite of dissension? And then place suspicion upon the attendees? Hmm. Traveler, of the unjust accusations placed upon you, one has become aware. The mind knows its answer. Though one must consult with one's fellows, lest the mind be misguided. Go, take your sigil of permission. Carry with you a message. Where should I go? Mountain Shaper and Cloud Retainer can be found here. Only fate will decide if you shall find them. Only fate. There exists a conqueror of demons, a guardian Yaksha. Go to Wangshu Inn. There you shall seek him. Wangshu Inn. Everything is centered around that. Cloud. Black clouds, too, shall pass, just as silver linings end. From sun or rain, all seems the same from the heights of Jayun Karst. New quests. Lots of new quests. All right, they want me at the mountain. They also want me at the inn. Inn was like in the center of everything. Here it is, function. Make sure I'm on the right quest because if I ask it to tell me where he is, here. It is. Oh, higher. I was just up there. Another book. Someday I'll read those books. All right, so I gotta climb up there. Easy way of doing it. I go up here and turn around. Here, watch this. Or that tree thing in Mobile that I was playing with. <sighs> T 
to the blood. <laughs> Everything may not be as it appears. There you are. Blue hair. A sigil of permission? You came prepared. Though this only prevents me from hurting you myself. Doesn't stop you from getting hurt in other ways. Too much contact with our world is breaking the rules. Mortal souls are not as robust as those of Adepti, nor can your blood carry this level of Adeptal energy. It's for your own good. Leave. Now. He's cold, too. Ugh! Paimon's peeved! All he does is think about himself! Paimon wants to give him an ugly nickname. But if you take off an Adeptus, the only thing you'll probably ever find in treasure chests is cabbages. Blech. Guess we should go ask the boss lady of the inn about just how she manages to talk to Adepti. Ask the boss lady about you. It's the uh, secretary downstairs. Hello. A distinctive but elusive dress sense defined yet a typical facial features and followed around everywhere by a floating elf companion. Hmm, nope, can't place you. Can you tell me, tell me about that Adeptus. Oh, he's already met Xiao. Not bad. Not often he's in a good enough mood to agree to see people. That's his good mood? Oh yes, the Adepti are very hard to come by. Many people go their whole lives praying to them, never once actually getting to see one. When the Geo Archon built Leo, he borrowed power from the Adepti. But most of them only know how to protect Leo by fighting. So for many millennia, it has instead been humans who have led Leo. Whilst the Adepti have lived hidden away on the outskirts. You really know a lot, huh, boss lady? <laughs> it's not boss lady, it's just boss. Anyway, seeing as you have the favor of the Adepti, things should be a lot easier. Well, if you want to know my opinion, if you keep Xiao in a good mood, things should be okay. Mm, let me guess, he likes... Good mood? Can't really imagine what a good mood looks like for that vigilant Yaksha. <laughs> Will be interesting, won't it? Come to think of it, I've never seen him smile either. How about this? You go see the chef for a bowl of almond tofu and a plate of whatever it is you're best at making. Almond tofu is one of the few human foods Xiao likes. The other dish is up to you. Up to us, eh? Hmm, what do you think you're the best at cooking? Perhaps Maha Manjasaka Hot Pyro Slime? Wow! Never heard of that one! Paima wants to try it! But if we're going to be cooking for an Adeptus, perhaps a satisfying salad would be the safer choice. Make a delicious, satisfying salad. I just have a satisfying salad. How do I make a delicious one? I just get lucky? I'll try it. Maybe a regular one is, counts as a cool. Delicious satisfying salad. Hey! I did it. Try another one, see what it is.
Another delicious one. Hey, how lucky am I? If I cook here, everything comes out delicious. Look at that. That is interesting. Did not know that. I found a little cute trick. I wonder if cooking here automatically comes out everything delicious. Let's just try it. Let's try a steak and see if it comes out delicious. Delicious steak. Oh. It's the secret place to cook. Oh, that was using amber may make a special dish. Yeah, so it could have been just a coincidence. Cool. All right, so that part's done. Now I talk to the chef, who's not here. What's he doing out there? What are you doing out of the kitchen, smiley Xiang Xiao? Can't you see him on a break, kid? Scram! Excuse me, we'd like an almond tofu. Scram! Whoa, this chef guy's service is about as good as that Wagner guy's back in Mindstat. It's for the boss, Goldet. <sighs> I see. If it's for the boss, then guess I don't have a choice now, do I? Nope. But my heart's not really in it right now. Not enough to make a dessert as painstaking as almond tofu. And why is that? A fencer's hand must be steady. So too must the hand of a chef. But my hands, I'm... They're not steady. I'll make the almond tofu, I know how. Because, uh, a, a traveler once told me that this inn... is haunted. And then just now, just now, in the kitchen, I saw something. Something not right. This chef looks so intimidating, but speak of ghosts and he becomes weak. I keep thinking, even Wong Shu In isn't safe. I can't keep a steady hand for something like almond tofu. All right, in the name of high quality almond tofu, we need to go tofu. check this kitchen out. Let's make some almond tofu. Uh, uh, it was a ghost. Uh, Tell the chef about what happened. The ghost ran out. What? Oh, you saw it too. There really is a ghost. Oh. Okay, so he's useless now. What do we do? Forget it. Let's just go see the boss lady again. <laughs> Scared of something so insignificant. Hard to believe he was once a notorious bandit. You don't seem that afraid of ghosts, boss lady. Gods and ghosts. I've seen it all before. Come to think of it, others don't seem to know there's an adeptus here at the inn except for the boss lady. Shh. Say any more and you'll be divulging my little secret. Right. Best you two be off. Go see to it that that little ghost doesn't go scaring anybody else. Not that I'm ordering you around. It's like the adeptus said. Mortal souls are not as robust as those of the adepti. So as not to be harmed when dealing with the Adepti, you can start by practicing with that ghost. How should I persuade the ghost? There is a calligraphy painting in the inn known as the Witness Sigil. It's been in circulation for over a thousand years. Go take a look at it. Once you have, look for a place outside where you can see the exact same Witness Sigil formation. Can't 
climb the wall. Is this it right here? It is. Alright. I think this is... Looks like it's going to open up another set of things. So what I'm going to do... Is put a cut in the video now. And then we'll pick up next time.